The Doppler effect is something that most high school students have experienced, but it's difficult to demonstrate in a classroom setting. The object traveling has to be moving fast enough to create sound waves so that the students can understand the shifts in frequency. The Doppler ball can be thrown with speeds sufficient enough so that students can recognize the changing sound pitches that define the Doppler effect. It's also fun to play with. Just snap the battery into place and push the holder into the slit in the ball, followed by the buzzer. Start tossing it around the room. If the ball is thrown fast enough, students will be able to recognize that the pitch is higher when the ball approaches them and is lower when it's moving away from them. Why does this occur? As the ball approaches, the sound waves bunch up in front of the ball. The wavelength becomes shorter, and in turn, the perceived pitch increases. When the ball moves away from you, the waves stretch out, and the frequency decreases. You can also tie a string tightly around the ball and swing it around in a circle. Students will be able to hear the pitch alternately increase and decrease as it moves toward them and away from them. It's also lots of fun.